What's going on guys, welcome back to the Fortified Gaming channel, I am Static, and we are back with more Call of Duty Ghosts Onslaught DLC on the PS4. This time we are here kill confirmed on the new map Fog, and now Fog is an exact replica of Camp Crystal Lake from the Friday the 13th movies, the Michael Meyer movies. Um, so that's pretty cool that they did that, and if you didn't know, which I think most people probably do, the first person, I believe it's the first person, to complete field orders can call gets a care package and they can call it in and most of the time it's a Michael Myers uh, care package so you drop it it drops in you become Michael Myers you have the max and an axe and everything and you run around you're pretty much like a maniac but you don't, have, you don't have any throwing knives or anything and you have an axe instead of just the regular knife but this is pretty cool they got different areas you can go you can breach down under here and go underneath the whole map and come up through the stairs on the other side This one's pretty tight quartered, close quarters as well. Not a whole lot of open in between. There's the second floor on that building and a couple little of the cabins over here. I'd say a submachine gun or a uh, shotgun is probably your best bet on a map like this. Either, you know, something like the Vector or one of the uh, pump action shotguns would be pretty well. Just because there's a lot of turns, like once you head into the middle of the map, it's kind of like a maze. You can go in, left, right, and then all different ways from in there. I don't know how they're getting it up faster than me. Is that Dom ready? Jill confirmed. But, yeah, so a little a tight quarter SMG or something like that is going to be your best bet. <clears throat> so this is, I'd say, it's a decent map. I do like the idea of recreating the whole Camp Crystal Lake and having uh, Michael Myers in it. I just wish, I think you can only, it only happens once a, it can only happen once a map, if I'm correct with that. And it's definitely not easy to get because with it with it being so close quarters the spawning is still kind of off so like people are just spawning all over the place and you can get the field orders but it's very difficult to i've found to complete it especially when the ones that you get are like get a kill while jumping or get a kill while doing this considering there's not a whole lot to you can't, there's nothing really to jump off of that's high enough for you to get the kill or you know get three kills with a non get three non-kill streak kills that's pretty difficult to do because just getting three kills in a row without dying on this map is pretty see like that I spawn and he's right in my face so <clears throat> it's a decent map a decent concept um, this is definitely the smallest map uh, on the DLC one of the, the tightest quartered one oh, really I don't even have another gun I can use this is pretty much it all right. Um. Enemy satcom spotted. So the kill confirm matches do last a decent amount of time on this map, especially since it's so close quarter. You don't really have time to get the kills, especially if you're doing it from a distance, and then go pick up the tags because there's always more than one dude right on top of you, so you can't really pick everything up. You gotta be quick on the trigger too, because you can't can't take the risk of turning the corner and a guy's right in your face. You don't know if it's a teammate or not, so you're shooting at everything that moves at this point. Enemy satcom spotted. That way. Oh, it's gone. Satcom up link enabled. Ammo crate ready. Oh damn! All right. Um, so I haven't seen, see, the, the way they made it sound when they announced the DLC and announced the fog map with Michael Myers was that Michael Myers is going to be something that happens at least every map. 
and that you know someone's gonna it's gonna be not not necessarily easy to get but it's not gonna be like insanely hard to get and it's gonna be you know an added element to this map that's gonna make it stand out from all the other ones but in the time I think I've played this map four times since I downloaded it yesterday this being the fourth time and Every, I haven't seen Michael Myers at all yet. No one that I've, none of my friends that have played it have gotten it, or have seen it at uh, at so far. Um, my brother playing the DLC last night. He played Fog almost consistently just to see if he could get it or if anyone else could get it, and he never saw it. So I know it can happen. I mean, I've seen videos, other YouTube videos of people being Michael Myers or them seeing him running around and all this so I know it's definitely possible but it's just not easy at all to get so what I'm gonna do is it's not looking like it's gonna happen this map I think the score limits 65 so it's not looking like it's gonna happen so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go into a private match and in a separate video I'm gonna go into a private match and I'm gonna put some bots on the other team because you can still get it in the private match I'm gonna put some bots on the other team and then I'm gonna just run around and see if I can get the Michael Myers real quick just to show you guys what it's like to be Michael Myers and because I don't want to I don't know how many episodes of this I'd have to record just before someone can actually get the, uh, the drop but it's still a it's still a good map it's just they made they focused their whole focus on this map was to be the whole Michael Myers part of it. And that's fine, but it doesn't happen, so I don't know if, if they should have made it ha easier to get. And then if it's still only once a map, you know, make it more than once, more than one person can get it. Because once a map, when it's that hard, by the time someone could get it, it could be towards the end of the map, you get it. Your team gets one more tag and then you're done. But I don't know. So I'll bring you a private match just to show you what uh, Michael Myers actually looks like. But that was Fog. It's a decent map. Very close quarters. Uh, so if you're going to play that map, when you play that map, use some type of submachine gun or a shotgun. There's really no point to be, nowhere to be distanced unless you're going to sit like in the roof of that building. But it, even then, it's still pretty close. So leave a like and favorite if you enjoyed. Subscribe to our channel Fortified Gaming for more Call of Duty Ghost videos. And I'll see you all in the next episode.